Lockheed Martin just revealed they're developing a classified weapon system that could change everything we know about modern warfare. This comes as the defense giant reported a $1.6 billion loss, mostly from this secret program that's been burning cash since 2018. CEO James Takelet called it game-changing and critical for both US and allied forces during recent investor calls. The company has already lost over $2.1 billion on this mysterious project since late 2024. But here's what makes this different from typical defense spending disasters. Tyklet told investors the program would become a profitable franchise, despite numerous future years of money-losing fixed price work. The Skunk Works division, famous for creating the U-2 spy plane and F-117 stealth fighter, is leading this classified effort. Air and Space Forces magazine reported the project involves technologies originally developed for the next-generation air dominance fighter competition. Lockheed lost that contract to Boeing, but decided to repurpose their advanced research. The CEO confirmed they're taking NGAD technologies and integrating them into current systems and future platforms. These could include directed energy weapons, hypersonic missiles, and AI-driven autonomy features that would give American forces an edge. Forces News noted, Lockheed has not gone into specifics, saying the information is classified. But financial filings reveal the Air Force considers this program vital to national security, despite the mounting costs. The $950 million charge in Q2 2025 alone shows the massive scale of this undertaking. Lockheed's willingness to absorb these losses suggests they see enormous future returns from whatever they're building. Tyklet stated directly, this is a highly classified program that can only be described as game-changing capability for our joint US and international customers. He added it's critical that it be successfully fielded despite the financial challenges. The program's connection to the failed NGAD bid reveals important context. Boeing won the sixth generation fighter contract, but Lockheed's response was to create something potentially even more revolutionary. Sources indicate the secret project could involve ultra-stealth aircraft, autonomous drones, or breakthrough weapons systems. The Skunk Works division's history suggests they're pushing technological boundaries far beyond conventional capabilities. Lockheed is positioning F-35 upgrades as a bridge to a future platform potentially labeled F-47. This new system might not enter service for another decade, but could incorporate the classified technologies being developed now. The CEO acknowledged the government customer is aware of the cost this program is putting on the company. He believes they're open to figuring out ways to make it more reasonable, given the strategic importance. This classified program represents more than just another defense contract. It's a bet on America's future military dominance. The willingness to lose billions suggests Lockheed sees this as essential for maintaining technological superiority. Recent Skunk Works projects include AI-powered surveillance systems and advanced drone capabilities. These developments hint at the direction of the secret program without revealing specific details. The financial losses haven't deterred Lockheed's commitment. Tyklet promised enhanced oversight and rapid incorporation of lessons learned to reduce risk over the coming years. China and Russia continue developing their own advanced weapons systems. This secret American program appears designed to maintain the technological advantage that has defined US military superiority. The program's multi-year timeline and fixed price contracts suggest the Pentagon sees this as a long-term investment in national security. Despite the costs, military leadership apparently believes the capability is worth the price. What exactly is Lockheed building in those classified facilities? The answer remains hidden, but the money trail suggests something that could redefine air warfare for decades to come.